Parents fearing for their child's safety, rushing to school after learning about a shooting. This happened this morning in the cafeteria of Italy High School. And tonight, a teenage girl is in the hospital. Yona Gavino is live at the school with what she's learned about the teen accused of opening fire. Yona? Yeah, fellow students who attend the school right behind me, they tell me that that shooter had a long history of violent outbursts, yelling and throwing things. They say it started with arguing, followed by gunfire. Inside the cafeteria at Italy High School, students described a scene of terror and chaos. We were stuck in a corner in the cafeteria for a minute because everybody was trying to get out and there was people losing their shoes and backpacks. Denasia McCowan called her mom as gunshots rang out. Officials say a 16-year-old boy shot a girl, a 15-year-old student. After he shot like twice, he, he tried to shoot the guy he, she was with. Officials have not released names or a motive, but several students told us the suspect liked the victim. She wanted a relationship and she, I don't think she, she wanted it. Outside Stafford Elementary School, worried parents lined up waiting for kids, some who witnessed the shooting. Are you okay? Yes, my mom okay. I'm just, you know, nervous. I saw, you know, how this girl, like one foot behind, uh, uh, in front of me got a shot. I was just so happy to see her face and see her come out okay. Officials tell us an Italy ISD staff member confronted the suspect in the cafeteria. He ran out and was taken into custody. Students say he was quiet and a loner. He has his moments every now and then. Like he'll just he'll get mad and he'll start throwing chairs and stuff, but nothing like this. And right now there is no word yet on any possible charges that the suspect may face. I'm told that there will actually be a lot of beefed up security deputies and police officers when the school reopens tomorrow. Live in Italy, Yona Govino, CBS 11 News.